I'm going to be entirely honest I'm with you. All alone. I hate you. I'm facing twilight alone. Huh. Your dashed handling of your unfortunate circumstances. Your uniqueness. Your ability to surpass me. All these irritate me. She wrote about how her parents hit her. How they made her take pictures in weird clothes. Kanchan's diaries was full of stories like that. Then I asked about asked her about it. She got really defensive. I felt terrible, but she just kept yelling at me for reading it. But it's impressive you managed to grow anything at all up on a rooftop of all places. I'm honored to hear you say that. You know, I can't say it tasted good, but it was actually somewhat refreshing. Kinda like how you feel good after taking bitter medicine. Time talk to Sojuro, yeah? Get that bond growing. I'm going to the church with Futaba. Sorry, but you're coming along too. Why are you going there? We're going to visit Wakaba's grave. Be ready in three minutes. I always think about Wakaba on the anniversary of her death, but it's been a while since I visited. I've been so busy with the shop. No, that's not it. The guilt is what kept me from coming. I thought Wakaba would be angry with me. But now that I managed to get Futaba over here, I can finally meet her with my head held high. I sure kept her waiting. But it felt good to tell her about how much Futaba's improved lately. Oh, I told her about you, too. Thank you. I should be the one thanking you. This is the first time the four of us are all together. Sojiro, what are you smirking for? Uh, this is what my real smile looks like. I approve. Whew. Oh, I have some news. The family court gave me a call the other day. Futaba's uncle decided to retract his report. It was because of you, wasn't it? Hmm. I wonder if the day will come that she goes out to be someone's bride. I'm sure she'll make a fine lady either way. After all, she is Wakaba's daughter. Do all fathers have to go through this anxiety? You know, I really just wanted to have you help out at the store. You showed me so much more. You showed me I have a family I need to protect. Not just Futaba, but you, too. I may not always be reliable, but feel free to come to me if anything happens. I'll be there for you, as family. And, uh, I know, I'll teach you everything I can. You're a full-fledged man now. That might not be enough to return the favor. That's all I can do. Thy body, thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Hierophant. Oh, well, that was it. All right. I didn't even know we were at the max. All right. Oh, and uh, could you not, uh, you know, get with Futaba? I can't imagine you calling me father. Although. Maybe it wouldn't be so bad. What are you two talking about? Nothing. I hunger. Curry time! Yeah, yeah. Let's go.
go home. Hmm. The wholesome glasses family. Literally, Sojiro is a better father to our protagonist than his own father, if his own father is still around. I mean, geez, your son supposedly gets into some sort of crime, and you immediately throw him out? What the fuck is that? Anyway, we'll be sending the calling card on the 18th, 10 days from now. Would you like to do anything before then? I want to train or I want to play? I want to play. I see. You maintain your composure. I suppose you are made of sternier stuff. Sterner stuff? Yeah, yeah. Very well. Our existence depends on this strategy. Let's do everything we can. Hmm. Grab your notes. Uh, didn't I give this guy a fucking, like, Squidward voice, I think? I'm pretty sure I gave this guy the fucking Squidward voice. I feel like I had to have. Last time we were talking about court trial work. Today we'll be learning about... What, you're asking the Phantom things will be given a trial if they get caught? <coughs> Of course they would. All they would need to do is prove a link between the deaths and their activities. In short, they would be put on trial for murder. Agreed. Huh? You know it, right? Tell me how old you have to be to listen in on a trial. It, well, okay, that seems pretty far, so... Also, this doesn't make sense. You want to be a baby, and you're going to listen in on a trial? What are you going to say? It's like, oh, please, tell us, little baby. W what did this man do? The rest you're going to get is a... This is it. Exactly. That's right. No age restriction for listening on a trial. You can get in whether you're 0 or 85. That's really dumb. Youth crimes are an exception, but it's basically open to the public, meaning you can all go attend. Well, I imagine the visitor seats will be full of the will be full of the phantom thieves to put to trial. Everyone is dying to know who exactly the culprits are and how they did it. Nice going. I'm surprised that they don't say something else. Uh. Time to get back to what I was doing here before Zack hopped on, and I didn't get to continue. Let's see. Let's go and see what On is up to. All we have to do now is send the calling card. I guess we can just lay low until then. Um, I'm thinking of going to see, uh, was it Shiho? Yeah, Shiho in the hospital. Do you think maybe we could go spend some time together before I go? Yes. Thanks. Hmm, what should I get for Shiho? It's hard deciding by myself. For real? Hey, I have some big news. The double cream from that famous crepe shop is half off right now. Uh... Mm. Oh, but I probably can't take... Uh, creep into the hospital, huh? I want one though. Do you think maybe Shiho would want one too? Maybe. In that case, I'll buy two. Though I guess she might have rehab today too. They probably wouldn't even let her eat it. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Shiho started her physical rehab. She pushed it up ahead of reschedule. I think it's because I told her about how I want to get stronger. She said she was going to start working hard too. I haven't actually seen any of her rehab sessions yet, though. Oh, hold on. What? Now? Oh, that's not good. Hmm? Sorry. 
Sorry, something just came up. That was from my agency. One of the models didn't show for a magazine shoot they're doing. They're looking, up, they're looking to wrap up soon, so I'm gonna head over to fill in. It's pretty close, though. Wanna come with? Actually, let's just go. I'll race you there. Wait, what? We arrived at the meeting spot. It looks like they're having a pre-shoot briefing. Try to guide- gotta remember my Joker voice. On Senpai! I'm so pumped to get to work with you today! After I saw you in last year's show, I just... Oh, I think I'm gonna cry! Uh, um, it really wasn't a big deal. That fashion show was tiny. By the way, I'm Mika, and please, no honorifics. I might be older, but you have loads more experience on Senpai. Alright, Mika. <laughs> it feels a little weird saying it like that. Oh, and you don't need to use Senpai with me. Anyway, uh, it's nice to meet you. Likewise, Anshan. <laughs> You're so nice. Hey, can you teach me how to be a better model? You know, your everyday routine stretches. Hmm? Routines? You mean like singing in the shower? Uh, oh, is that all you do? Then what kind of stuff do you eat? I've been looking all over the place to, for some important, to, for, that, for a place to import some organic green almonds. Plus I'm getting super tired of eating, what is that? Do I need to like, boil it in hard water or something? Mm -hmm. Um, almonds? I only ever eat those when I'm, when they're covered in chocolate. And hard water? Isn't it kind of tough to boil ice? Mmm. Do you weigh yourself? Oh, of course. Once a year for the health examinations at school. Mmm. So, you're gonna keep it all secret from me, huh? I get it. I guess it's hard trusting someone you just met. But that's not it. I, I just don't really think about that stuff. It has nothing to do with me not with with, uh, with not trusting you. It's more that modeling is like a hobby for me. Uh. Ooh. <laughs> we you pissed her off. What? On senpai, that's horrible. What do you mean you don't care about modeling for these guys? You said that on Sean. Oh, wait, I, I I love this magazine. Everyone tries so hard to make sure their product is the best. Hey, Mika-chan, just calm down. Don't worry, we all know that you're giving it your all here. But, you guys work so much harder than me, and I'm still the one getting comforted. Wait. Oh, hold on. Anchan, the truth is, we'd both you and Mika-chan come down as substitutes for our missing model. We wanted both of you on the cover, but you're really not interested. Hey, I didn't... Don't worry, I I can do it alone. I read the concept docs on my way here. <laughs> what? Hmm? You faker! You're so mean, Anshan. Do you really hate me that much? Keep it civil for you two. Anyway, you good to go, Mikachan? Sorry about all this, Anshan. We won't be needing you today. We'll reimburse your transportation expenses, though. You even throw in a little extra for your trouble. Oh. But... The magazine staff left for the photo shoot. I really screwed that up. Uh, bro, did we not notice she was being a bitch? Huh. You're outmatched. Yeah, but maybe it's because deep down I'm not actually that invested in modeling. She seems straight, though. She seems straight, though. Anyway, I totally ruined the shoot. Uh... But still, wasn't Mika's fake crying pretty incredible? It had grace. Do you think... Oh, maybe that's what I'm missing. I don't know, though. I think I'm pretty good at fake crying myself. I know the perfect technique. So, how do you do it? Listen carefully. The key is, you don't actually cry. I mean, that's why it's called fake. Yes! Either way, I think I'll be able to use the ability to our advantage in the metaverse. I'll turn my failure today into positive energy going forward. 
Hmm. I sense a heightened motivation from on. All right. Speaking of the metaverse, I'm gonna try super hard in my work with the Phantom Thieves too. But for now, I should go stop by and see Shiho at the hospital. Thanks, Thanks for today. Hmm. Just really gotta get back into my Joker. Ah, you're, you're back. back. Yes, indeed. Well, I've already finished with him. Huh, I don't wanna. I don't think Hifumi's available. Who's over here? Chiaki and stuff. Rock. I thought I couldn't do anything with what's his name because isn't there another? Let's go see. I don't know if I have a request blocking him. Don't worry. I didn't say a word about you guys to those dumb cops. So you did the request I asked you to do. Thanks. Oh, so I've been researching that actor and I came across some substantial new info. Are you free to hear what I found? It says, but. He said thank you for the request. Oh, see you later. Huh, come on. Yeah, he, he said you did the request. So, let's go. All right. Thanks. Let's head to the diner then. Um. So you know that actor I suggest as your next target? Apparently, he's marrying the, the idol from those rumors. He probably just couldn't live with himself after what he did to her. His reputation did a total 180 after he announced the marriage, though. People used to hate him, but now all everyone wants to want to talk about is how sweet and manly he is. At any rate, we can't oppose the will of the public. Good thing we decided not to change his heart. Support for the Phantom Thieves would have really dropped if we had. I need to make sure our next target is one we can win against. And what exactly will we win? <laughs> Proof. Proof that we're the ones doing the right thing. Actually... Oh, by the way, I came up with a new plan of attack. If we really want to make you guys famous, we need to do more than just answer promising requests. Right now, there are tons of idiots out there doubting you, and trying to influence ours to do the same. So, we're gonna purge them. You really need to chill. Sorry. Uh, sorry about that. Purge is a pretty disturbing word, huh? There's n not really any better way to phrase it, though. The truth is, I looked up some of these idiots who are criticizing you and sent them warning messages. You know, like, if you don't change your wicked ways, you'll be our next target. What? I'll have you know, it's been... It's been working wonders. They'll totally stop dissing the P-thieves. There are still some people who say they don't believe, but deep down, they're just afraid of you guys. <laughs> Isn't that great? <sighs> Plus, now all those haters are gone, people are putting a bunch more info on the forum. Post after post, it's all please and help me. <laughs> this is so much fun. This isn't like you. All I did is find my own way to change people's hearts. I'm above the simple stuff, like producing and advertising now. I can change the world. I have the strength to do that now. Oh. Eh? <sighs> Akiyama-kun. Yo, Mishima. I haven't seen you since graduation. <laughs> we actually saw each other here not that long ago. Oh, yeah. I guess you're right. Hmm? Akiyama-kun? What? Are you okay? What do you mean? Does it look like I ain't okay? I don't know, you just seem... quiet. Shut your mouth, Zero. I don't got time to be listening to you. Zero. Damn it. He acts like I'm a total nothing, but he still tries to take time and mess with me. I've changed, though. I'm way better than a loser like him. I even heard he's been hanging out with some shady people. They're all scum. 
I wish we could change their hearts for the good of our society. Oh. Wait, that's it! We can change his heart instead of that actor's! Alright, it's decided. Your next target is gonna be Akiyama kun. Let's see. Where's his info? Um, speaking of targets. Are you guys gonna come after me someday too? Are you feeling guilty? Huh? You're really considering it? <laughs> Good show, Green. See you around. Anyway, I'm heading home. I'll send you Akiyama kun's info later. Machine was trying to push a target on us to advance his own agenda. I should discuss this with the others. Ah, oh, Mishima. You were a good kid, and now you're messing up. Mm. I might focus on this. So, he just wants us to get revenge on a guy who made fun of him? Didn't he give us some other in other weird request too? Something about that handsome actor? Is Mishima-kun trying to take advantage of us? Apparently, he has also threatened anyone who dares speak ill of the Phantom Thieves on his forum. Perhaps we should enact a change of heart on Mishima, not this Akiyama fellow. Wait, hold on. Whoa, wait up. He ain't that bad. Yep. Hmm, I guess we could find out what's happening if we manage to find his shadow. I mean, he's already worried that we're gonna change his heart, right? We'll probably be able to track his shadow and the mementos. All things considered, I think our best course of action will be to defeat it and change his heart. Mm. Mishima-kun, it feels almost wrong to consider such an option. But... We can't have him causing problems for us, though. Either way, we can decide whether or not we change his heart later. For now, we must meet his shadow. Let's go. Now, let's yeah, let's head into Mementos and track down Mishima's shadow. Right now? Oh shit, okay, that's good. Like, that's good. <gasps> Who are you? Could you be the Phantom Thieves? So you want to change my heart, even after everything I've done for you guys? Me, of all people. If you just shut up and listen to what I told you, the Phantom Thieves would get even more famous. And if you did that, I'd get some of the spotlight too. I wouldn't be just some stupid zero anymore. There's finally some hope back in my life. So why? Why are you so insistent on stopping me? Yo losers, get out of here. I want to talk to your leader, alone. Go on. This is all your fault. Before you came along, I knew my role in life. I was supposed to be the guy everyone messed with. I'd accepted that I was a zero, and embraced it even. But once I figured out you were one of the Phantom Thieves, everything changed. You just had to get close to me. I mean, seeing a real-life hero do all this amazing stuff made me wish I could do some- be something more. I want to change society, too. I want the world to notice me. If I can just make the Phantom Thieves famous, maybe I'll end up famous, too. Would that really satisfy you? I don't know. I'm not sure. But I don't have any other choice. I don't have any special powers like you guys. Heck, nobody even pays attention to me. In the end, that's why I need you guys. You're the only way I'll be able to make a name for myself. I know it's wrong. But if I can't push my way into the spotlight now, when will I? Anyway, just bring it on already. You're here to fight, aren't you? What? You aren't gonna change my heart? Do it yourself. Come on, let's go. I'm sure you learned something if he's been spending all this time with us amazing heroes, yeah? No. No. I need the Phantom Thieves. I need to be famous. I need to... You sure this is even gonna work? The lower house disbanded. It was an internal split. 
Oh, so Yoshi's Shido. He's the only one. Whoa. He's the only one that can stand up for what's right. The only one who will make good on his word. That's the kind of person we need leading this nation, especially in times like this. Shido leads the United Future Movement, right? He was right. If we'd taken the Phantom Thieves seriously from the start, they'd be behind bars by now. Which will come first, do you think? Richmond change or the apparition abber of the Phantom Thieves? All I know is I'm about to be arrested soon. The day we go to, to, to the casino is the day Joker goes back to prison. Including the day we gotta carry out the plan, there's only 11 days left. Time is really slipping away. What will happen to us if we fail? We won't fail. It's kind of tough to say that, that for sure. Maybe, but we can't lose heart before we've even done anything. If we do that, we'll just mess everything up, even the parts we definitely succeed in. Hmm. You actually said something wise for once. You wanna fight? You two get along so well. Uh, how so? That is an outrageous claim. That's what I should be saying! Come on, stop it. Let's try to keep tensions low. We're all feeling anxious. Even you, Makoto? Yes, it can't really be helped this time. That's not how I raised you. Get a hold of yourself, Ryuji! Why are you singling me out? Hey. Yeah, I know how many days we have left, you stupid fucking cat! Oh, well, yeah, everyone else is ignored. You know what we're going for. Permission to go practice in the school gym. I just need to do some training size. Does that sound okay? Oh, hell yeah! Let's go see her. Sure. Oh, but do you want to get some food in the cafeteria first? I'll go ahead and grab us some seats first. I'll be waiting for you in the cafeteria, senpai. Senpai? Having lunch with a nice, beautiful girl? <laughs> I never could have dreamed it for myself. I mean, wait, did I say that out loud? I'm sorry I called you here so suddenly. Since our talk, I've been trying to think of things besides gymnastics that I'm really invested in. And I figured something out. It's this. Making bento? Yes. Yeah, I can cook. You really need to re uh, regulate your, your diet in gymnastics, so I've been making my own food a lot. And so, since I also wanted to thank you, I made you bento. This is actually my first time cooking for someone else besides my family. But I figured this would definitely help me get my confidence back. I made this specifically with your body type in mind. And knowing how much you exercise, do you want it? <laughs> I'm touched. <laughs> and I'm glad I put all the effort in it. The chicken and eggs are to help you with your fatigue. There are some beans in there too, and it's on, and it's on brown rice. Weight control is important for gymnasts. But we also need to make sure we've got energy and stamina too. So high protein, low fat is usually what we go for. We also need iron to maintain stamina and vitamin B for energy. Wait, I'm getting all focused on the gymnastics part again. Well, anyway. Hmm. This looks good. Let's dig in. Is all that for you? Of course. I'll need every last grain of rice. Why? Uh, why do you look so skeptical, Green Senpai? I guess it might look a lot, but this is actually a little less than my usual. Don't worry, I've done the math on the calories. I'll burn all this off at practice. Huh. Come on, Senpai, you'll be done before you know it. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. This is... Hmm. Hmm. It's familiar flavor, but it doesn't match the food. Um, mm. I keep trying different parts, but it all tastes the same. Something very familiar. Um. Green Senpai? You okay? Your eyes are glazing over. <laughs> this taste. It's definitely unique. You think so? I don't think it's that weird for an athlete. Heavy seasoning would probably be bad for you, so I went easy on it. Hmm, was it too light? I excuse me. Mm, yeah, that's the flavor I was going for. 
I was trying to decide how to season these, and I figured everyone likes curry, right? So I decided to go for maximum curry flavoring. Huh. I'm sorry, were you not a fan of that flavor? Or wait, maybe you prefer the super spicy ones? Not exactly. I'm so sorry. I did all this I did this all wrong. I'll go get some kind of condiment to change the flavor. Once I fix it, I'm sure you'll enjoy it more. Should I get mayonnaise? Soy sauce? Maybe miso. Do you think Dr. Maruki will have some salt? Calm down. Oh, you're right. I just buy something new so you can eat it now. <sighs> I'm enjoying this. Um, but... Well, thank you. Now we should really eat. Yeah. Thank you for the meal. Whew, that was delicious. Thank you for com completely finishing your meal, Green Senpai. I'm sorry it didn't turn out perfectly. I came up with the idea of making bento, but I couldn't decide on the flavor. Either way, I'm really sorry. I'm so embarrassed. I thought it was so great when I presented it to you, and now... <laughs> you could try again sometime? Thank you so You're much. very kind, Green Senpai. Next time, I'll ask what you like before I try anything too crazy. I'll go buy that super spicy Miguel sauce for next time. Um, <laughs> it seems like you're always helping me find my way forward, Senpai. If I didn't have you, I'd let my failures get to me and end up in some big pessimistic spiral again. Maybe this kind of confidence can help me figure out who I really am. <laughs> that sounds right. Either way, I suppose all I can do now is keep moving forward. Green Senpai, I hope we can help- we can keep- oh, uh, I hope we can keep helping each other improve. I can sense Kasumi's passion. Three! I thought we were higher than that. Okay, now that we've gotten all our nutrients, it's time for the next phase. I don't mean to be too demanding, but I'm going to train you even harder than before. Make sure you keep up. Um... We went to the gymnasium and trained ourselves. Thanks to Kasumi's training, I feel like my stamina increased. All right. Oh, I guess we're out of time. Maybe some other time. I guess we'll end it here for today. Hope we can do this again sometime. Not getting the call on the phone, or usually we get the call on the phone. Okay, no call on the phone. Uh, you're back. No call on the phone. 